What's up everyone? Hope you're all staying safe um, with everything going on. Just thought I'd do a quick video um, doing a comparison between some LiPo batteries. Um, in this one I'm doing it between the Radiant Supra Packs 5300 mAh and the Turnergy Heavy Duty 5000 mAh. Um, the reason I'm doing this is because I'm getting a little bit fed up with spending money on LiPo batteries which quite clearly um, don't show or are, or are not what they say on the pack um so this is just a quick video um to really show that and i'll put a link to a website um that i have found subsequent to that which gives a good insight into um battery ratings and what they truly are i um, hope you enjoy um please remember to subscribe if you do thanks a lot okay well i'm just going to give it a quick run on the radiant lipos you see what sort of speed you get out of it um, Again, that was just some quick speed runs, stock pinion um, on the Radiant Lipos, the 5300 milliamp hours 3F. Lipos. Okay, just going to give this a quick run now on the Energy, heavy duty, 5000 milliamp hour batteries. I'm plugging this in. Yeah, I hadn't. Turn it on.
a quick run with the uh, so Turner G heavy duty 500 milliamp batteries. Okay, everyone, so we've just been for a uh, just got back from the run with both the Radiant Super Packs and the Turner G's, and now we're going to charge them from flat or LVC up to full. Um, you can see the Two radiant super super packs, 5,300 milliamps are plugged in. Uh, we've got a channel one that's showing this is where it LVC'd 9%, 3.65 volts, and um, channel two showing 3.6 volts. Um, if we do the um, internal resistance check as well, and that one showing internal resistance of between 9 ohms and 12 ohms on channel 1 and then so internal resistance of 16 um, I'm now going to put them in for you and charge them Okay, so that's both the radiants done, and as you can see, 42 minutes on that battery to um, charge from LVC up to fully charged, and you can see that's 100% charged, 4.2, 4.2, 4.2, back, and you can see quite clearly there, that has only taken 3,519 milliamp hours. That is supposed to be a 5,300 milliamp hour battery. Um, second one took 3,444 milliamps from LVC, 41 minutes to charge, and again, that's fully charged. And just in case anyone's thinking, I'll check the batteries out. That is 5,300 milliamp hour radiant super pack. And the other one again, the 3S 5300 milliamp hour radiant super packs. Well, I'm going to show it again. This one here yeah, in channel two that took 3,519 milliamp hours from LVC, and the other one 3,444 41 milliamp hours from LVC. These are not 5,300 milliamp hour batteries, they are misrepresented and fake. Well, fake is the wrong word, but they are falsely advertising what they are. Um, I bought these from a reputable model shop um, and more than likely will be taking them back and, and showing them my evidence but I just wanted other people to know before they start spending money on these that they are not as advertised. Um, I'll now move on and charge the turnages which were half the price of these um, and they're only 5,000 milliamp hours. I will charge them from LVC and see what they take. Okay, guys, now we're going to do the same. These were run the same day, same time, down to LVC. This is the Turner G, 5000 milliamp hour, heavy duty. Um, I plug these in. Um, 
it's the same one I just put a protection around it um, but again this is Turnergy heavy duty 5000 milliamp hour um, again we'll, we'll charge that from LVC So that's the turnage is charged um, from LVC, same as the radiance. Um, but as you can quite clearly see, these took a lot more charge to take them up to charged. Um, 4,810 milliamp hours to take from LVC. And you can see that's fully charged, took 59 minutes to charge it. And the other one took 4,679 milliamp hours from LVC. Um, these are rated at 5,000 milliamp hours. So there's no hokey pokey going on. So the turnages outperform the Radiant Supra packs, which are, I think these are about £60 each, um, and these are £40, or £38 roughly, um, from Hobby King. Um, far better battery than these, which are quite clearly not 5,300 milliamp hour batteries. Um, very disappointed with them, in fact. Okay, well, I hope you found this useful, um, and don't forget to subscribe, um, stay safe everyone, bye.